G'day guys, Skits here, and welcome to a regular post-game commentary, which is something I haven't done in a while, actually. I've been uh, playing a lot of FIFA recently, and obviously I've been doing the survive mode. Uh, but today, I've, I'm finally, after what, four months of Modern Warfare 3 being out, I've finally given you guys a Moab gameplay. And um, I'm, I'm not going to lie and say that, you know, I, I got this with ease. I've been actually been trying to get this for the last two weeks. And i got to say, it's, it's kind of made my enjoyment of this game so much Oh, worse. I just, I hate, I hate, I've hated this game for two weeks, but, um, finally yesterday, last night at like 10, uh, 10 p.m., I finally got the Moab, and obviously by no means, as you can see, the length of this video, as you can see, the gun I'm using right now, and as you can see, uh, everything about it just isn't that good, you know, like, everyone's standards of Moabs these days are just amazing, really quick Moabs with, like, random guns, but obviously this is my first Moab, it's been, you know, like five months, and I've finally gotten it. Um, it's, it's actually really harder than it seems to get a mob. I mean, I've died, I've gotten so unlucky, I'm not going to lie. I've gotten, to, I've been on a 23 kill streak four times, that means I've been one off four times. I've gotten 22 kill streaks, I think, twice. I've gotten many, like, 19 kill streaks, 18 kill streaks, and stuff like that. And I always just die, I mean, it just gets really ridiculous, and I was getting really sick of it, but I really wanted to get a mob, so I decided to get a little party of, I think, two or three people. Guy with Hard with Style actually has a channel. I'll leave his channel in the description if you guys want to check him out. Um, but basically, him and a few other of my mates helped me out getting this Moab. I mean, I'm pretty sure they weren't helping me too much, but I think one of them was using a UAV, which helped quite a lot. I was actually using a wide range of guns throughout this gameplay. I was using. I started off with the Scar, which obviously is, you know, not the hardest gun to use. It's basically the gun I'm comfortable with, and that's when I, I figured going for this Moab, I was going to use a gun that I wanted to use and that I was comfortable with. As you can see, I did get lucky at times, you know, random times where I nearly should have died and stuff like that. But, I mean, that's all part of getting a Moab. Uh, but, anyway, I started using the MP7, the FAD, the, even, like, random secondaries at times. I was really mixing it up, using lots of different guns. And I thought it was, you know, a reasonably enjoyable gameplay. Um, even though, obviously, it was quite a lengthy Moab. I mean, I want to start... The thing is, it's funny because as soon as I got this gameplay, I went out into another game and got, like, a 20 kill streak and died, obviously. But I'm playing much more confidently these days. I reckon I'm going to be getting heaps more Moab. Now that I've gotten one, um, it was a little bit campy at times, as you'll notice. Um, but then again, it is on dome, and the way to play dome, in my opinion, is to kind of camp a little bit, just kind of secure positions. I wouldn't say camp, but just kind of pursue, um, sorry, secure positions. Um, as you can see, we're getting triple capped at the moment, so I'm a bit scared for where they're spawning. But with dome, it is quite a hard map to play, in my opinion. A lot of people struggle to get mobs on dome. I mean. I'm not exactly the best uh, 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 person to ask about how to get Moabs, except of what, I, of what I've seen, Dome is definitely a harder map to get a Moab on. Uh, but definitely just secure an area and kind of lock down a position. And you can generally do pretty well on this map. I mean, the, my main tactic for getting a Moab and my main way that I've been, you know, trying to get Moabs is this that was pretty nice shooting there through that little tarp thing. But basically, you just choose a gun you're comfortable with. You go into a game not really thinking about a mob too much, and you just don't think about how many kills you need. Basically, after you get specialist, you just need to play as though you need more kills. And when you get the mob, you get the mob. You know, it just comes at a random time. And that's basically how you get mobs. Like, you don't go into a game and play tactically and do all that stuff, or else you'll just choke and you'll die, because that's how, at least how I found it to be. I mean, obviously, you got to stay cautious, and when you're up in those high kill streaks, like 15 and above, you got to start playing really carefully. You know, you can't just run around like an idiot. Here, you'll just say I'm spraying into this building, getting lots of assists and stuff like that. I see that uh, a lot of perks, I mean, obviously having all perks helps you out a lot, but i got to say, a recent perk that I found out that is just amazing is our Recon Pro, and basically what it does is, uh, the pro version, the pro variant of it, basically, if you shoot an enemy, they are advanced UAV'd for like 30 seconds. Or sorry, blackbirded for like 30 seconds. So if you shoot an enemy once, get a hit marker, then you need to reload, you'll know exactly where he is. So it's an amazing perk. I definitely recommend you guys get it pro. Uh, but in general, guys, unfortunately, I didn't have too much time to talk. But um, basically, my first mob, expect more mob gameplays, expect more Modern Warfare 3 commentaries now that I've gotten the mob. Basically, I've been trying to get a mob for the past like two weeks, and just it's just been making my enjoyment of this game, you know, it's just been making this game so annoying for me. Um, obviously, I helped it help out quite a lot, but basically, I've got new thoughts of this game. After getting this mob and after playing it a bit today and last night a fair bit, I've got new thoughts of this game. And those thoughts are that it's a hard game, but when it's when you play it well, it's so rewarding and it's really a lot of fun. I'm actually really enjoying it these days, so you can expect way more of this stuff back on my channel. I know that I took a little break from this game, but... Um, I'm really enjoying this game at the moment. I mean, there is all that crap that pisses me off and stuff like that, but I'm, I'm gonna, I'm not gonna lie. Like this game is actually a really solid game, and I'm not gonna hate it just because it's the new COD and that's what everyone does. 
As you can see there, I get the Moab and I die as soon as I get it. I get it here and if my if you guys heard my reaction, I was I was quite happy about that. Uh, I get the Moab and then obviously I die here again, which kind of sucks. But anyway guys, hope you enjoyed the gameplay. Please leave a like if you want to see more Moabs and I'll really try to get them for you guys. But anyway guys, thanks for watching and I know it was a crap Moab, but see you guys later. Bye.